playoffs for high school boys volleyball begins this week. And for the Punahou Buff and Blue, that means their streak is back on the line. Our Sienna Pillaton caught up with the 10-time reigning and defending state champs. A dominant performance from the Punahou boys volleyball team, sweeping rival Kamehameha. The Buff and Blue completed an undefeated 10-0 season and will go into the ILH playoffs as the number one seed. One of our philosophies as a team and as a coach is to not worry about anything that happens in the past, just keep thinking about the next game and the next challenge and how to overcome that. And while they're not looking in the rearview mirror, the team is aware of Punahou's historic past, winning the last 10 state titles. There's a long list of names that of like volleyball legends that came from this school, so it's good. To, it feels great to be a part of it, and um, it just makes us want to get better and try to be like the best team that could be. Yeah, I think Punahou has always been known for having really good sports teams and being able to be a part of one and being able to represent it. Uh, it's been kind of a blessing for all of us. And for some, representing the Buff and Blue is personal. Yeah, it's great. Like my mom and my grandma both graduated from the school, so it's great to just keep the legacy going. Yeah, same here. Everyone in my family came here, almost everyone. So it feels good to do the same. And when it's all said and done, the team bids aloha to nine seniors. This is the first time in our program's history where a group of seniors have collectively made a senior shirt together. And I think that in and of itself symbolizes this team more than any other team that I've had in the past. And you know, to be, to be honest, like this team is talented, but it's not the most talented team I've had in terms of skills, right? But this could be the most talented team I've had in terms of intangibles. Punahou gets the first round by and will play either St. Louis or Hawaii Baptist on Thursday at 6 p.m. Reporting in Honolulu, Sienna Peloton, Hawaii News Now.